Skywatch Media News for January the 23rd, 2021. There is a genuine concern in the scientific community that planet Earth is encountering a substantial influx of incoming meteors and asteroids. Satellite observations conducted in recent years indicate that fireballs and bolids are crashing through the atmosphere at a more frequent rate, which is being established by recent data, which I will provide to you in a moment. When analyzing the critical data of incoming space rocks and cosmic debris, scientists look at the size and the rotational velocity of the object to better predict the risk it may impose here on Earth. As is often the case, the incoming rock may be an interplanetary particle no larger than the size of a pea. But routinely, there can be asteroid or meteor fragments as big as basketballs or even small cars that will crash into the atmosphere. Some of these rocks reach the Earth's surface or explode just above the surface, which can result in a fairly substantial shock wave, much like what was witnessed in Shelobinsk, Russia, nearly eight years ago. When something significant enters the Earth's atmosphere, scientists want to know about it. But unfortunately, quite a few events go undetected by the human eye because daylight drowns them out, or because the world is two-thirds water, and therefore they are not always visible to observers on the ground. If not for our modern technological capabilities, we would never have known about them. Over the last couple of decades, events such as the powerful fireball that exploded over the wilds of eastern Russia in December of 2018 have been detected by satellite, providing priceless observational information to researchers on the time, location, and energy output derived from the fireballs. Fireball data provided by the surveillance satellites is critical in assessing impact hazards. The data, along with the astronomical observations of larger near-Earth asteroids, will define the nature of the impact hazard, and it will allow for the subsequent planning on how to deal with the issue when it arises. As example, the fireball data, along with the infrasound, allowed scientists to verify the approximate size and energy of the unusual Caracas meteor crater that occurred on the Peru-Bolivia border in September 15th of the year 2007. But more important than the scientific value, these rare bright fireballs provide a better understanding to the public regarding asteroid impact hazards especially among those people who live in remote locations, who believe that they have witnessed a mysterious or extraordinary event. Nowadays, the amount of information readily available regarding incoming space rocks is being diminished. Critical information is being cut off, leaving scientists blindsided. What this entails is that a high number of space rocks that are exploding in the Earth's atmosphere are now being secretly classified, which means that the general public is unaware of their occurrence. So where do we stand when determining the known numbers, frequency, and impact intensity of global fireball events over the past few years? To do this, we must examine a series of fireball charts that are provided by the American Meteor Society. One of the more critical data sets involves fireballs that travel long distances across vast geographical areas. This chart indicates that November and December of 2020 were all-time record-breaking months for multi-state and country fireballs. Both of these months also set all-time records for the observation period of this particular subset. When determining huge event fireballs, the American Meteor Society will evaluate the number of eyewitness reports for each event. 
If the number of reports equals or exceeds 100, then that event is considered to be significant, as was the case when a bright fireball passed above Ohio in September of last year, prompting more than 700 eyewitness reports. But this was just one of many significant events last year. As you can see from this data set, 2020 was another record breaker for huge fireball events, a total of 35 for the year. 2019 and 2017 were the second highest years, coming in at 30 events. As shown in this chart, the year 2017 has the single highest recorded month taking place in November, but in that year, there were only 10 months where huge events were recorded, whereas in 2019 and 2020, there were huge events in all 12 months. The monthly total fireballs are the most critical category. The data set indicates that the monthly total of observable fireballs for the year 2020 has established a new record high. Furthermore, the number of fireball sightings has increased substantially over the period of four years shown here. So now we have a similar pattern being established for all three subsets provided by the American Meteor Society. There is one particular aspect of the monthly fireball totals that is disturbing. Last year, there were a total of 10 months where the number of fireballs exceeded those of the previous three years. 2019 saw a similar pattern, but with lower numbers. One thing of interest in this chart is that the month of March 2020 provided the fewest number of fireball sightings. It's quite possible that the numbers were skewed during this month as a result of the lockdown with more people isolated indoors and unable to observe the sky. It is quite possible that the Earth is moving into the outer edge of a ring where comet and asteroid fragments are prevalent, which could bring us closer to the likelihood of an impact event, which then brings us to the yearly fireball totals. Notice the dramatic uptick between 2011 and 2013, and again between 2018 and 2020. The overall figures in the data set indicate that the numbers have increased steadily in the past decade, which is another worrisome sign. If we look at the bar graph of the past decade, a similar pattern emerges displaying a continuous uptick in the number of fireballs. Of particular interest is the trend line after 2012, which shows a steady and dramatic uptick through the year 2020. If we are entering into a dense field where asteroids and meteors are prevalent, then it stands to reason that we will continue to see a steady and substantial increase in reported fireballs for each year going forward. January 2021 is off to a good start with regard to the number of fireball reports. Already there are nearly 500 global sightings in the first three weeks of the new year. On January 22nd, a very bright slow-moving meteor fireball described as a green ball of light was spotted by many observers at around 7.50 local time. The object was seen across much of the Netherlands and across parts of Belgium. The fireball, which was reported to be moving south, was captured on camera from both countries.
The sky above you is as magnificent as it is infinite. If you take but a moment in your day to stand beneath it, you will forever feel its beauty and its presence. Stay safe, everyone. Thanks for watching, and always keep looking to the sky.